Hello? 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 Hi, this is Catherine with the Medicare Department at Healthcare Benefits. How are you today? Healthcarebenefits.com. I'm calling because the updated plan for Medicare has been released and it may give you some better access to things like dental, vision, hearing, and over-the-counter benefits. Now, I believe you do have Medicare Part A and B, correct? Correcto mundo. Okay. Sarah. Are you transferring me to a licensed agent, Sarah? Nope, she hung up on me. Hello? 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 Yeah, hi, this is Mark with the Festive Health. How are you doing today? This is Mark? Yeah. Mark. How are you doing today, sir? I'm doing pretty good. You coming over? Actually, just based on our records that show that, that you are qualified to receive a latest technology talking diabetic testing monitor, which will be covered under your health insurance as well as free shipping. So are you diabetic? Well, what, what's, what are you, what's this thing about? I don't understand. Say it slower. Actually, sir, we are going to provide you the latest technology talking diabetic testing monitor, which will be covered under your health insurance as well as free shipping. So are you diabetic? Am I diabetic? Yes. Okay. And how many times a day you check your blood sugar level, like once a day, twice a day, or more than that? Well, it depends. The doctor says I need to do it like four or five times a day, but I get busy, mm -hmm. and so I only check it like once or twice. But I know the doctor, man, he said, Mark, that I should check it more often than that, but it's just a waste of time and pain, and, and you know, no one got no time for that, Mark. Yeah, I can understand it, sir, but yeah. as you're checking it at least once or twice a day, yeah. that's also fine. Yeah. At least you're checking it, okay? Yeah. So, just for the recording purpose, sir, yeah. Uh, we are going to provide you the latest technology, talking diabetic testing monitor, which will be covered under your Medicare health insurance as well as free shipping right at your doorstep. Mark, so you, you said, you Mark, Mark, hold on a minute, Mark, you said a monitor? Like no, a, like a computer, a computer screen Medicare. monitor? Like for the computer? No, sir, I didn't say that. I was saying that we are going to provide you the latest technology. Oh, what kind of technology, Mark? Monitor. What's the technology? Yeah my, yeah, my health advisor is going to explain you each and everything in the details. But first of all, we need to verify some basic information from your side that I'm going to connect you on the same line with that. So do you have Medicare Part A and Part B both? Yeah, A and B, yeah. Okay, and are you located in the state of Arizona? Yeah, we live here in Zona. Okay, and just for your shipment process for the new monitor, just for the recording purpose, what is your first and last name? Well, first name is uh, B-E-N, and last name is C-H-O-D. Okay, you have a nice day, sir. Bye-bye. What happened, Mark? <laughs> He don't like my name, <laughs> dumbass. <laughs> Hello? Yes, hello? Hello? Hi, this is Alan. How are you today? I'm doing pretty good today, Alan. Okay. Actually, the reason of my call is to make sure have you received a blue letter from the state like two days ago? Received a letter from the state? Yep. I think I did. Or should I open it? Uh, it's a blue letter, sir, along with a book. I don't know. I didn't open it. I just laid it on the counter. Oh, my goodness. That's wonderful. So if you got the letter, that means, sir, you are perfectly entitled. Because last Friday, Medicare recently announced state allowances for respected persons. 
and you are the respected Medicare holder, that's why you got the letter. So right now, you press me for now. You have Medicare Part A and Part B active, right? Yeah, did I need to go get that envelope? No, you don't need to get the envelope. Let me tell you why I'm calling you right now. So yeah. right now, you press me for now. You have Medicare Part A and Part B active, right? Yeah, how'd you know that? And you are... So if you got the letter, which means you are, you are, you have Medicare Part A and Part B, it doesn't make any sense. So right now, uh, you are residing in Arizona as well. Yeah, I live in Arizona. Wonderful. So right now, let me tell you, these are the state allowances and state benefits. That's why we are calling you. What, the good what, thing is that right now. What happens if we sorry? decide to move to Clearwater, Florida? Oh, don't have an answer to that. Uh-oh, hung up on me on that one, dumbass. Hello? 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 Yeah, I'm just Nicholas here with Affordable Care Act. How you doing? Doing pretty good today, Nicholas. to get you qualified for free health insurance and government subsidized for the Affordable Care Act. So I believe you're below the age of 65, correct? Uh, yes, yes, I am. Yes. Well, that's not. Hello? Hello. Yeah, so this is Steve. How are you doing? Steve, I'm doing pretty good today. Oh, that's great. So that's great. So this calls regarding to provide Medicare Part C and D. So can you tell me, do you have Medicare Part A B? Did you say C and B or A and B? I'm saying we will provide you the Medicare Part C and D with additional benefits. Oh, C so and D. I C, C yeah, and D. So I believe, like cock and yeah, dick. I believe you have... Right? C and no, D? No. C and D. No. A and B or C and D? No. Which one is it, son? C and D. D, D, and, and D. D and D? What are you trying to say, son? Uh, so it's a C and D. Like C is for... Like C, we can, C uh, as in Charlie? No. Uh, a as an apple? B. <laughs> Learn to speak up, dumbass. <laughs>